Hi guys, it's your girl Kyra Wills and welcome back to Next Topic. I'm Fred Santana. I'm Temi Alchemy. And we have, oh yeah. And I'm Sean Shallow. Took it away I then. feel like, yeah, I'm here, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Been here. <laughs> Been here. <laughs> Been here. <laughs> oh yeah, big man. Sam. Charles, my guy. It's the deal. You got first. Is something good? Pick it out, we're efficient now, isn't it? Yeah, and it's quick. Got a whip drink. Oi, 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 oi. Nanks back in the days. Nanks back in the days used to be mad, you had the push out things. Relax. Chill. Yeah. What are you promoting? It's not that program. Cool. 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 Is this what you were doing when you were younger? What? Is this what you were doing when you were younger? Padding. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. What's that? Padding. Padding. <laughs> mm, I'm like padded bras. It's padding. Well, that's what I thought you were Padding. Yeah. Yeah. No, you, man, I'm different. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, next topic. Uh, what's padding? <laughs> It's bras, isn't it? <laughs> no, no, you know what I'm saying. Reason to it, reason to it. He's Bush, he's saying pardon in the African accent. Oh. <laughs> Fucking hell, bro. He's not in Africa, is it? I'm half African, but... Jesus. Um, said I'm half African. <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> I'm African and Caribbean. You can't be half a continent. Yeah, you can't be half a continent. I was going to say that. Where are you from, that country? I'm Ugandan and Jamaican. Oh. Alright, cool. That's fine. Uh, you know the comments are going to be... <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm half African, half Caribbean. Like, what no, the hell? No, sure, sure, no, you sure, don't sure. always stick it on me and then everyone else wants to cuss me out. Anyway. <laughs> don't start having a breakdown no, now. No, shut up. Like, <laughs> have shut some Soraka oh. relax, yeah. Chill out. You always do yeah. this when guests are here. Like, I swear <laughs> you should put it on. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know <laughs> girls do that? You know like when you're on the phone? To her, the brown and she follow me like, right now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes, hey, nah, you better talk to me. Say, say you love me. <laughs> Can we go on to the topic? Sorry, go on. Yeah. All right, so next topic is wireless ban on swearing and types of clothing. Then we also have the versatility, which AJ Tracy said about artists, be, he, him being the most diverse artist, mm. versatile artist. And then we mm. also have the direction of the music scene. Have you been wireless? To shops? To shops? Yeah. In wireless? Yeah, like, just as, like, uh, in the crowd? Yeah. After we perform in wireless, I normally just go into the crowd. Yeah, after, yeah, How many times have you performed? I performed in wireless once, and I went um, when Gecko performed as well. Yeah. Right. Yeah, so what, so you got booked as an artist and then supported Gecko? No. Bo, uh-huh. bust us through... Um, me and Ads to perform. Like That's the that. first time like we that. got That's to perform good. at Wireless. And then Gecko bought so Ads for Colas. I thought you always had. I remember you got kicked out once. Who? No, this Snoops. was like. This, this Bo was like one of the first people to ever do Wireless. Mm. Yeah. And then when he done it, he brought us in to, right. to do it. As so well. now, because the last time he was supposed to be on stage, they kicked him out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I he's been booked yeah. before that. He's been booked before that. That's yeah, mad. Yeah. That's and so it was going off. And at that point, it was going off. Yeah, 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 yeah I'm, sure. Yeah, I'm sure. Where, where sure. was it? That was it at Finsbury Park still at that point. Uh, what was the other one? Was it High Park? Park. Park? It was High Park. Oh yeah, it was, it was in High Park. Park. Yeah, it was in High Park. Park. So Bo got booked, brought you and ads out. Fuck out of there. And then Gecko got booked and brought for ads out for Colas. They got a tune together. That tune's hard. Colas is always a sick tune because there's that one with Ra. Mm-hmm. Codes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What do you think of that R A and um, gigs tune? I ain't even heard it yet. Yeah, no. Heard it. No, I what do you think? It. I should take it in. I don't. I don't. I don't like it. You don't like it. I didn't like it. Um, I thought. I feel like you know what it is with gigs. He's just having fun. Gigs is gigs has got too much money now. That's just how I see it. I don't feel like. He's passionate about what he's doing. No, no, I feel, no, no, I feel like he's passionate. I feel he's passionate. Do you know who I'd say that, piece, that, piece, that, that applies, piece, applies piece. to his chip? But go on, say your piece, <laughs> say your piece. Say your piece. Like, say piece. gonna get me on the snippet <laughs> talking wild about gigs. Say your piece. You know what I'm saying? When gigs puts a story out about you, you know what I'm saying? You know what talking wild about gigs? I love gigs. You know what I'm saying? I just reckon, I'm not saying he's not passionate, but I feel like he's in that mode of, he's cruising right now, he's just chilling. I he's feel like if you used to in his him years ago, of course, obviously on the come up, you're always going to be firing. Mm-hmm. And right now, I feel like I can listen to gigs and I'll be like, 
He didn't go too hard on that. That wasn't old school gigs, you know what I'm saying? That was just like, I'm doing a feature, let me come true, you know I'm not gonna do shit, you know I'll just do my own thing and go. I ain't heard a passionate thing from gigs in a while. Essence. Yeah, you know, obviously that's on his own thing, but what I'm saying is just features. Oh, yeah, yeah, like I haven't heard anything which is mad. I was just like, oh yeah, that was alright. But for for the caliber of artists on that RA and gigs tune, I thought it could have been better, blood. Like, uh, I just don't like. Yeah, but anyway. Happened. So we're talking about wireless and the ban on, ban on swearing. I thought it was a joke. Yeah. And swearing. clothing. Yeah, that's a joke thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said don't be wearing anything which is um. They said skimpy clothing and shit. Skimpy on stuff. Is it is it skimp? I thought it would have been things like. Like things that kind of show. What's what's skin. what's like a no Cleavage. not like skin. You know, like when you're wearing a top and it like represents like Black Lives Matter or something like that. Do you know? Oh, what I mean? right. oh I right. It was, right. I thought it was like maybe something like that. But they said skin peak clothing. Is that what they said? I yeah. did, I never read the articles yeah. when I said when I saw it, the headline. I was like, a lot. A lot of you know these songs are cancelled then, isn't it? Or just yeah. bare bleeped out yeah, or. They Put a limit on the age then, cause what? Like, of course, how? What's the age limit? Everyone anyway? swears. They can't get no six nine on that then, innit? Do you know what it probably means? Everyone it probably swears. means they're probably gonna stream it on TV or something, then, innit? Like BBC or something. Everyone. But because, then even if because, you do that, it has to be oh okay, as in like the swearing. Why? Because if it's on BBC, they're not gonna allow swearing in it. You know yeah. What I mean? So if people are swearing, it's gonna. What's, what's the word like it's going to be detrimental to the channel so they might have mm. signed a TV deal but then that's going to affect yeah, ticket sales yeah. if they see that Russ I don't have to go to wireless yeah yeah of course of course it's, nah, it's nah. Gonna, it's so go hopefully it's not a fucking still, TV nah, nah, deal man. you can't be watching wireless on TV nah, nah, yeah, yeah, but gonna, do you know how much the, that, that could be thing, more yeah. convenient because you no, won't miss a no, thing because you know how they put the Olympics on TV you can press the red button and you can go to that's people that can't pay and get in yeah, yeah, cause if someone can't pay demanding. to go wireless, brother, they're not going home to watch wireless on their TV. Bear, fam, I watch I'm concerts on Snapchat. Probably, 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 probably watch Coachella. watch Coachella when it was. But then I feel like that's because it's in a different country. For me, it's enough to watch it on Snap because I'll see twenty seconds of my favorite song and yeah. be like, but, I but, but, but you know, that's that's you though. A lot of people are like, I need to go there to yeah, experience to it. Like people fly over. But it might, but that might affect sales on a. Friday and Saturday because your favourite artist is only on a Sunday so you're like I'm not getting the full weekend package mm. I'm getting there's the still, Sunday there's only. still a lot of fucking people in London and still yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. But feel like if they do go TV is... that's definitely affecting themselves I feel like if football wasn't on TV this is all speculation it. yeah it's all, for me yeah because I'm feel like we're really running with this but TV the only, yeah the only way <laughs> the only reason I could see them having an issue with swearing like there's not that much swearing anyway like it's not that mad. It, it's just a joke. It's just a joke, bro. Because I'm sure COVID, there's 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 yeah. probably like rock festivals where they're probably doing a madness, if not more madness than in Talk wireless. Like, and, and to say skimpy clothing, and this is an issue which people have had with wireless for a time, is that there's not that many women being booked anyway. Yeah. So right. to say there's skimpy clothing, it's like. Which artist was wearing mad clothes? Like, which female artist was but dressed skimpy with her nipple out? But who are they to say how someone should dress? Ain't like, isn't that, that like an obvious yeah. thing? Yeah. I feel like, I, I don't know sure. if we're going to say, is, are we going to call wireless a black festival before we start saying they're trying to limit urban music? Are we? Because I'm just that's a question. Nah, I've always seen wireless as a, a white festival. Definitely. Yeah, that had that book black artists. It's in it's in it's in England. Yeah, if it was in Africa, it's a black festival. If it's in England, come on, the percentage is 93% white mm. blood. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Regardless of the race of artists, even fucking the I don't know where that African percentage art. came from. Nah, I just made it up. Okay. <laughs> it's on the liquor. It's on the liquor. Because <laughs> 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 that's going to go with it. I don't need to just confirm. Is this right? Where are you giving the message that you're going with that? Is this right? Made it but, up. Like, yeah. and, and that's what I'm saying, because a lot of people might say, oh, they're trying to um, limit our creativity of, like, you know, urban culture and all that kind of stuff. But at the same time, is it an urban festival? Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that's yeah. the first question before we start jumping out the window to it against black So people. is it an urban festival is the first question. Why is that the yeah. first question? It, that's, just, that's just what I've seen people say, oh, it's because black people and blah, blah, blah. Black well, we people can't, we can't always take the route to be like, oh, it's black people. Do you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like, but yeah, yeah. I, I like, want to ask an artist. Yeah. So you're a black artist. Is it? <laughs> Why do you put that emphasis on black? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm going to be black, innit? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're fucking on the train of thought. So you're a black artist, yeah. yeah. When you first started music, 
so it's a two part question. What was the predominant race of your following? Oh, you can't really say that to me though, because I make music with ads, so I've got a lot of Arab followers. Cool. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So it wasn't really like, yeah, True. white family. So it's different for you. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's talk about someone then that's close to you, Sneakbo. Yeah. yeah. When he started out, what was the predominant race of his following? And then he, he, no, it was it was black, but, but he had a lot it, of people from Midlands that. So that what's it grown to as he's got bigger? Because do you feel London, which is the biggest black, has the most black people mm-hmm. out of like when you compare it to the Midlands? Mm-hmm. Do you think he's more popular in the Midlands now mm-hmm. than he is in London? So his following is more Caucasian. Do you know what I'm saying? Eh? No, I hear that, but. This is the thing with me. I feel like people always be popping more out of the area than the area they live in. Because That's mad because it's that other way round in mm-hmm. like America. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know, I know. When like when you're yeah, in America, the city, the city loves you, love yeah, 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 and then yeah, that's yeah, how yeah. you get out there. Yeah, but yeah. In in that areas like Brixton, especially, I feel like raw. You have to get the love from out of the area first mm. for you to receive. That's mad because when you you got even you included, it all started. There wasn't yeah. social media to push you yeah, yeah. in like. Tottenham, yeah, or, yeah, yeah, therefore, or yeah, Hackney, yeah, yeah. That you was, places, bro. yeah, you was therefore. popping in Kennerton, in Brixton, in Camberwell, the locals, yeah. because mm. it had to be Bluetooth to send yeah. the music. Mm. Now this thing is accessible all over the bro. world. It's a bit different, still, mm. but <laughs> I don't get what. I don't know what he's getting at with. Is it wireless? I don't get it. I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know what he's getting at. I'm just like, what are you talking about? He'll come back to me again. I was thinking, like, where is he getting with wireless? He's know. on his drink. Okay. So, listen. what's the thing? No, wait, so man, no, no. Oh, go on. I'm good, bro. Cool. <laughs> look, listen. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, look, with swearing, yeah, the, it's more than that with wireless, though. Because what they've said is that people in the council were actually complaining about it. And wow. they're trying to get it banned. They were trying to actually get rid of wireless. But they didn't Man. manage to. They said Even Harry Gay Council... As well, blood. They said Harry Gay Council, whatever, was actually fighting for it because they said it actually pays for the park yeah. for a year. Yeah, but people in the area are saying, right, it's kind of like carnival. Like, they said someone took a shit on my doorstep. What the fuck is going on? Get over it. Yeah, 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 fucking yeah, open yeah, your door. Like, open your, it, your like, door and let man shit in it. I'll yeah, tell you like, two pounds. Some people so, there's there's only 50,000 people coming through your area on the weekend. Because you're one of them um, carnival dresses, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> there's only 50,000 people coming through your area on the weekend is mad. So they're like, we hey, don't listen, want it. Though, but how long has wireless been going on for? I don't know. i say like... Eight, ten years, I think. But is then it? it was okay. previously at Hyde Park, yeah. so it's been a long time. And they got rid of it, so yeah, yeah it's just always moving. So but I don't I know what's going to happen. It's Park, like not bigger than Hyde Park. My, no. Is no. it not? Is it not a small? Start, it started in 2005. Oh, it started in 2005. Hyde Park is massive, though. It's been in so Finsbury Park for about six years now. So maybe. what? So, and Finsbury Park is yeah. smaller? Than Hyde Park, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Hyde Park is and massive. And that's mad because Finsbury Park is more... It's more of a of a residential area than Hyde Park. Hyde Park around it is okay. You got the yeah, hotel. Yeah. You got Western. But it's because if it's bigger, yeah, yeah, yeah. where it actually is in the park, yeah, 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 is in a more central area, isn't it? Than Frisby Park. That's mad. That's yeah, mad. They're, 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 so they're not too happy. So, so what's it like? What's it like so on the stage at um, Wireless? Bro, this thing just ooh, bubbly, <laughs> it's a wet wire. It's a baby wire. <laughs> I thought it was tissue. Man, I got set tissue. up. Are you listening? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got set up. Yeah, I got set up. Out. I got the liquor in me. I don't know what I got. <laughs> Are you listening? What was, what's the question? <laughs> <laughs> I got set up. <laughs> what um? Yeah, what's what it like was, performing at Wireless? No, nah, that that's what's like one of the you? most rememberable nights. I remember. I still remember it. No, still. Yeah, I was in the pe- yeah. Pepsi one. Yeah, mm. yeah. But that one was. Big. It five. was a it was a big one when we when it was back then. Yeah, it was yeah. in like old twelve, I think it was. Okay. okay. I think it was that Pepsi is a five. Yeah, so it was it was wavy. The tent. Mm. Yeah, yeah, Pepsi's yeah. A five. Big tent. Wavy. Because I remember that same year, um, Krypton Conan had like a smaller stage, and they was upset with their stage that mm. they had. Yeah. But they yeah. still they still made it do with what they had, and then they got the bigger stage. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. And they was mad happy, but they kind of mm-hmm. mocked them with the stage they gave them at that that point in store. Because mm. they deserved. What was the reception like for you personally? No, I, I it was all love. Mm. Mm. It was. I, I literally like. I, that's why I remember it as like one of the best times. Cause like, the reception and that was mad. Mm. Like he bought us up. 
and I think it was Pump Her Up. It was that the one tune that we got to to perform. As every, everyone was singing along to it. And everyone was on it. Like, right. So that's what I'm saying. Like, when we are talking about, ah, uh, I don't fuck with my early career. Mm. That man's all finding himself. This is where you're doing them kind of tunes and you're on wireless. This is part of the journey, nah. Like, yes, it's all part of the journey. Mm, it's like, all part of the you journey. Can't of finding you can't say you can't say you don't you don't fuck with it or your career's only six years because mm, no, nah, but six years that's know. that's that old talk. No, that's six years. Obviously, you know. yeah, the, thing is, <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, it's a, it's a, di- it's a different sound, and obviously, people have done different Ooh. things to get on. I don't, Ooh. I don't know what it will be like in terms of like how you would get onto wireless now. What yeah, yeah, yeah. it'd like. be a, like a whole but different. But versatility journey. was obviously a thing that we're hearing about with what AJ Tracy saying that he was the most versatile artist. So I don't know he said that. He said that. He so said do you <laughs> that. Do we do we agree? And a lot of people because I'm, I'm wondering what there, you think. There, there was a think? Con- there, and it got into a heated uh, Twitter debate of obviously who's the most versatile artist, and people were gunning for J Huss and Young Bane. Who are the most versatile? Mm. As the two, as one or the most versatile, like they mm. were saying, Huss and Bane, and mm. then mm. more people were gunning for Huss. Um, oh, but then, then a few people were gunning for Bane because he can do the commercial features better than Huss. Huss hasn't really done. No, no you see Bane. Bane is Bane. So Bane, Bane is, is a very. I can't it's argue with Bane. Bane. Like it's arguable because I can't just say oh, he's. He could do that. his own thing on Froze. He could do his own thing on. Um, but you know what? I don't. Tune? I don't think I haven't what? heard Bane rap in a very long time. Yeah, that's this. But this do you is think he's I don't know if that's his. Style anymore? Do you get what I'm saying? Do you think he's lost it? Do you think he could lose it? No, I don't think you can lose it. Lose it. But like when I've heard him rap, like on on certain things, what was it? Um, what's the tune that he did? A two. Um, with uh, sucks. The flare. And I was like, this sounds alright, but he sounds out of place. Like he don't sound like he should be on this kind of beat anymore. Do you get what I'm saying? So, I don't know where he is in regards to rap, but in terms of being versatile, commercial, the radio being on tunes that have a vibe, that Rihanna tune is like one of the best fucking R and B sort of things I've heard come out of the UK, bro. Like that tune's yeah, fucking that, like, fantastic, bro. That melody on that, everything. That's sick. mad. I I, like, I'm still, I really that, want to know if he wrote it, honestly. No, no, no that's how sick it is. Serious, like, have, I'm shocked. Right. If he's wrote that, that's right. fucking amazing. Whoever did it is amazing. So Bane is a good shout. Huss is a good shout. I don't know where you think AJ Tracy versatile? would have got that. From I them. think Huss is versatile, but I think he's in, he's in, quite in one rooms. he's quite one directional. Do you, mm. do you think Huss is okay, versatile? Okay, okay, let's think of his album. Let's think of his album. Go on. His album. Get, do you want to get the playlist out? Yeah, yeah, I I want to see. I, I'm not even going to remember the songs like that okay. unless I, no, actually, it's, no, no, no. Huss is versatile. Yeah. Let's get, a, get his album up and let's have a look. So, in terms of AJ Tracy being versatile. What what sort of nah. versatility? I love AJ. Uh, no, no, no. He got, no, AJ I know, I know. He's definitely versatile. I just want to say he's the most yeah. versatile. He, get, he gets on different songs, but is his verse versatile? No, the when, song when we're talking might about versatile, yeah, what are we talking about? But is about, his though? verse versatile? And so can he can he sing? Can he rap? Can he do auto tune? Can he do drill? Can he do grime? Can he do rap? Can he do whatever? Can he do can he do soul? Can he do metaphors? Can he do yeah? Can can that's do all the yeah, 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 yeah. You know yeah. what? You know that radar thing Go when on. he was like spitting on all the bars and they were like raising the. the but that's BPM. a beat. Oh, yeah, the same. Same, yeah, yeah, same um, thing. All right, J Us, Common Sense, yeah, Wolf Daddy, Clarting. So that's even a sort of hood thing. Leave me, closed doors. Oh, Did you see? One, um, like your style, plotting, sweet cheeks. Wait, hold on, fisherman. hold on, Tim, hold on. Go on. Mm-hmm. What's that song? And is that um, ah, uh, on Big Span? No, no. Yeah, the soldier. Feel the zeal and the empire. Yeah, yeah, that's um, my spirit. Is that verse? Yeah, that's verse. Uh, that is definitely verse at all, bro. What are you talking about? Goodies, good. No, no, yeah, yeah. J House is up there, J. Oh, yeah. Versatile. Yeah, it, I'm not gonna lie. Look at the different styles of what we music. just said. That consistent ver- versatile is genres and not necessarily yeah because but, you're but, on the song but your verse on the like that's what plotting. makes Look up Stormzy plotting. that's what makes Stormzy versatile because he's a drill artist who can no wait wait 
Whoa. No, no, not Joe, not Joe. He's a grand artist. Sirak, 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 Sirak. You better publish that. Sirak. Boy. Sirak, Sirak, Sirak. You better be getting paid and check that out. <laughs> <laughs> Man said he's a real artist. artist. Sorry. He's a grand artist yeah. who can rap yeah. and did a I wouldn't say he's still gra- a grand artist anymore. No. That's what I'm saying. He's so he's a grand artist, artist, artist who can rap who did a gospel album. Mm-hmm. That's album versatility. or song? Yeah. Very song. true. Yeah, what you, you took it fast. What do you, what do you, what do you yeah, think? Like gospel three three songs. Three songs. Three songs. Three songs. Yeah. Well, gospel-esque. Gospel-esque. Yeah. Yeah. How yeah. many yeah. songs were Grime-esque? Yeah, but I didn't... Would I you say the majority of that... He's a rapper. Stormzy's a rapper. But he's when, Grime first, when we he's a When we see articles about the album, it gets coined as... Grand. A gospel album. Yeah, well, that's, that's a mainstream but, media. Yeah, that's mainstream media. Media. Jesus but he's Christ. a mainstream. He's a mainstream like artist. Album, like. He's a mainstream artist. Yeah. But could that's AJ like, Tracy yeah. do gospel? I think. No, Jay, I think no, no, no. No, 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 that's unfair. That's God, unfair. Okay, you God. can't say because could he do gospel? Because like, but that's included in versatility. Gospel is more to do with the message. Because man could just put a message on or a drill the sound beat and it's the track. Drill. And your, yeah, yeah, yeah. The sound of your track, the sound of the track, and your verse has to be considered in versatility. I've yeah. never heard AJ Tracy do anything outside of grime and rap. Maybe, maybe. Well, maybe that's just his genre. As, mm-hmm. Yeah, but then, but then he's he to call that it, statement, to, yeah, yeah, he's making that statement. Jay uh, Huss and Bane, I think, are more versatile than him. To see, it, to see it like this year, Bane can jump on tunes like with Young Abs on that and do his thing, and mm. then he can jump on tunes with um, Demi Levito and remixes and do yeah, his yeah. thing. Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm going to go for Bane. So I you have to say Bane. I'm going to go for so Bane. So Bane over Huss and Tracy. In terms yeah, of versatility, yeah. Both, fam. Mm-hmm. Both sick. I ain't Both even, I ain't even heard, on, um, no offence to Trace, but I ain't even heard Tracy on a song that's not different to what he does normally mm. and if he counts notes as his versatility it's like bruh well, yeah butterflies is oh, the only yeah. song I've heard that's yeah, different yeah, that's, 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 that's the only different. one that's different, got different songs yeah. did you guys what? like that track nah what butterflies it's not that yeah, it's yeah, shit like that song. it's not that it's but shit I never liked that first, but, 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 but when yeah, it when it when it when it is it is it grown on you? Yeah, grown on me. So I may, I might have I to like listen that. to it. But when I was li- when I was looking at the lineup for Rated Awards Track of the Year and they mm. won it, I was like, Nah, that wasn't it. What do but you think? it's what a do you voting think? thing. What, what song you think should Jumpy. Like it? Jumpy. Jumpy. I think Jumpy should have won Track of the Year. Mm. And there was no, definitely yeah. other songs but in that category. I think it's too early. It's too late. Though. It's too late. It's definitely a song of the year, but it came. No, but it came before the nominations were announced. Yeah, but that's too soon. No, 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 it's too soon. It's too soon. But sometimes you know nah, that. Come soon. on, look. If Unforgettable, mm. which was a huge Sutton, came two months before an awards like the BETs, it would have been nominated and probably... I'd, I'd forget it. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> direction of the, the scene. <laughs> so it would have been long to explain. Yeah, direction yeah, yeah. of the scene. <laughs> Fucking people are saying that the two leading genres right now is Afrobeats and Drill. Mm-hmm. But they're also saying they could die out oh. quite Afro quickly. Why would Afro, Afro swing? Beats and Drill be the leading genres if, what, what you, if Fredo and Dave made number one with a hip-hop song? Good point. Mm. Okay. So where's good the Drill and Thing artists on the charts and that then? That's a very good but point. Remember, mm. That's charts. See, when you talk, for me, mm-hmm. when you talk scene... As you, in what's we never in really include the charts because that's always influenced by outside parties. But that's the scene mm-hmm. now. Mm-hmm. The scene mm-hmm. is... But mm-hmm. see when, mm-hmm. You see, when, you, when we talk scene, mm-hmm. we talk us. And you see when you say us... We are see, part of the scene now. Though. No, no, mm-hmm. we are the scene. Yeah, yeah so literally. So those 16-year-olds that pay their 99p for tracks, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Them Fiat 500 drivers. <laughs> you mm-hmm. are following me here, innit? Go on. They influence the scene from the outside. Mm. Because they just consume, they don't contribute. Mm. So, <laughs> <laughs> just let them go. Just let them go. Let them keep going. Let them keep going. Do you not know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, go, on, go, on, go on. Yeah, yeah, go on. It will get too <laughs> political, but the direction of the scene is 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 what we make based mm-hmm. on what our consumers. Consume, innit? Oh my god. Because <laughs> <laughs> the way these men are looking at me, yeah? Because you said they pay, and you said they only consume, they don't consume. Let me try to explain what he's trying to say. What he's trying to say is that we create the music that we want to create. Yeah. If we have 500 people, as he refers to them, yeah. they pay for that music and which boosts it up. In yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, have you ever paid for music? No. You pay like, for your no, subscription, but, like, yeah. but you don't. 
by yeah, yeah, yeah. singles. I get you. I get, I get what you're saying. You know I get what, what I'm saying? saying. I get what you're saying. So, yeah, yeah. They pay, but they're not really the scene. Like they don't, yeah, they don't yeah, live yeah, where yeah, we yeah. live. They don't. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, they're not gonna talk about what we're talking about. Mm. Yeah, 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 so they yeah. consume. I get it. So in terms of like the direction, okay, cool. Funky Friday made it, mm-hmm. but that's not because of us. It's mm. because of them, innit? it. Right. So in terms of yeah, the majority, it has, us to, as well, it has right? something to do yeah, with us because we well. stream it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, you see, yeah. them pays they count for a lot more yeah, than yeah. a single stream. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So when we talk about the popping genres with in the scene yeah, yeah. we know drill is blatantly is something yeah, yeah. really definitely, definitely, definitely loud yeah. and afro swing too mm. more so than dave as an individual mm. what okay what's the question a question here is what do we feel could come next if let's say drill is getting like marginalized like you can't put drill out because of the references in it and if we're saying afro beats is dying i don't know how but let's say if it was to say i right, afro beats isn't the way what or afro swing, swing or, sorry afro. what could be i don't like coin i don't even think afro it, swing. i don't even so think it could be it? afro beats it's afro beats it's afro beats, it's afro beats. like and it's not afro mm. what's it some people say afro okay jazz, okay afro okay but here's, here's a question here's like, a question we, when sneakbo jumps on um touch a button what genre is that because if we say it's Afro Swing when a man like Jay House jumps on an Afro beat sort of beat, then it's Afro Swing. What genre is Sneak Bow? That's Bashman. You, you call it Bashman? Yeah. Bash All right, bash cool. Yeah. So then it's Afro Beats. Cool. That's fine. I don't like so, to say, because people have a lot of names for it, like Afro yeah. Swing, Afro mm-hmm. Bashman, Afro Hot. I understand Afro that, but if... <laughs> it's just like, <laughs> no, it's just like, let's just call it Afro Beats. I hear yeah, that, yeah, but yeah. me umbrella. personally, if I'm, if I'm searching for Bashman, I'm looking to hear Vibes, Movado, yeah, yeah. whatever, I'm not looking yeah, to hear Sneak Bow. Like, but he'd be in the mix no, because he'd be in the mix because he does a lot of Bashman as well. I hear that, but th- that's, to me, that's not Bashman. Or like even Afro swing, Afro beats. If I want to hear Afro swing, I'm gonna be going to those UK artists. I'm not gonna be searching so for them in. So are you gonna categorize the Af- them as UK artists? No, Afro swing. When you go on Spotify, it's like Afro swing. No. Mm. So you'll categorize. That's a, that's, it's, it's, a mo- it's, it's a mainstream media thing because again, mm. Spotify will put that playlist there. Yeah, so yeah, now yeah, you yeah, Put it. Now you yeah. think because they said it, man. I exactly. Say it too. No, so where do you yeah, think yeah. The, where do you think the scene's going in terms? Which genre is gonna take 2019 predictions? Genre, I think they're gonna make another thing about it. I didn't like know where Joe came from, the next thing you know, it happened. Bell Octavian's coming up. Like. I think, yeah, there's a lot of that. There's gonna be a little Uzi wave. Alternate rap. Yeah. Yeah. Do you not think that's her already? You say some bad hair yeah. niggas. <laughs> oh, yeah, some yeah, Lil's. UK coffees. Man. Fair news. I'm saying this. Let's get into the next topic.